Well, hello everyone. It's a crisp morning here this morning and I've got an idea for uh, a topic I'd like to share with you about water wells. So in 2020 I'd like to do several videos explaining different um, areas around your home that you can improve on and, and just give you an understanding a little bit about different things. And today's topic on water wells is going to help you understand a little bit about water flow and uh, water quantity. So in this case you can see here this is my well it's a it's a six inch well and I have lots of water but in some cases if you're buying an acreage you're not going to necessarily have lots of water so it's an, it's important to understand how much water you have in the well ready to be used and how much or how fast I should say that water will recover if you use it quickly so if you look here this area right here has flooded on me recently because I've had a broken water main uh, in the yard and it, uh, it caused a lot of trouble. But because my well produces 45 gallons a minute, it just kept pumping and pumping and pumping. And by the time I found it, it, was, uh, it had made a mess. Uh, in your case, in a lot of cases, you might not have a good recovery rate. So it's important to understand the relationship between the diameter of the well and the amount, the, how quickly, basically, I'm trying to make this simple, how quickly the water comes back into the well after you use it. So, for instance, on a six inch well, you have one and a half gallons of water for every foot of water in the well. And the calculation to figure this out is pretty simple. It's just pi r squared times the height. So, if you're going to go by a foot, then you, it's 12, um, not just one. But for every inch of water, basically, um, can't remember the calculation but basically it's a one and a half gallons per per foot of water so if you are using five gallons of water a minute out of a out of a garden hose let's say and you forget and leave it on then your well is dropping uh, every minute it's dropping three and a half gallons of water so um, or three and a half well but two and a half feet every minute so if you only have about 30 feet of well water, you're going to run out of water pretty quick. A lot of wells are board wells, so they're, they're larger diameter. They might be 2 feet or 30 inches or 3 feet. So let's use a, a 2 foot well, for example. In a 2 foot well, you have about 23 gallons of water, if I did the math correctly, uh, for every foot in the well. So if you have 20 feet of water in that well, then you have about 460 gallons of water to use. So once again, if you use your garden hose at five gallons a minute, then that water is going to deplete, that 20 feet of water will deplete in about two hours. And if it's coming in, let's say it comes back in to the well at one gallon a minute, then um, it's going to take about eight hours for that well to come back up to the top. So you have to be careful with the amount of water you're using. You have to understand when you're buying an acreage, what is the recovery rate? What is the reserve rate? Um, and as so long as you know these things, I think you can, you're can. you going to be safe. You're going to understand how things work and you're going to, it, basically it'll prevent you from draining your well down and, and having your pump sucking air.